going back to when it was cold, it is this man from Kendlin Cumbria's job to keep down the local corvid population. Crows are blamed for eating the eyes out of baby lambs as they're being born. Rooks damage crops and jackdaws steal nestlings and eggs. It is often said by the wise that the trickier the quarry, the earlier you have to wake up and the more and better kit you need. This crow controller is no slouch on kit. Just put the, uh, the lofting bird up there, there's, a, there's an old dead tree just in the woods there that the, the sentinel birds tend to sit in, right at the very top. And if we can stop them sitting up there by putting one up here, hopefully they'll be a bit, bit less wary and, and come into the park a bit better. The birds are within sight, but not within shot. Despite feeding them in and passing them feeding there daily as nonchalantly as he can, they are showing no interest in the food today. Corvids are better at counterintelligence than the KGB. They just come in and eat in all the, the cattle feed, uh, going in, in and out of the barns and, and taking the feed, so farmers have to pay for, for feeding the crows, so that's just to come and get rid of them. And um, this is a free service you provide? It is, yeah. It's, uh, it's all funded by myself. <laughs> Don't get uh, anything for doing it, uh, other than the, the joy of being out and shooting the crows. After dawn does her stuff and floods the Lakeland Fells with sunlight, even this weak, wintry sort, we must be highly visible. So it's time to move. The new farm we go to has more natural cover. It's on top of a small hill and birds can appear suddenly from any angle. At last, the only bird to come close enough for a shot. So what kind of gun is best for this work? I've got the SX-3, that's um, the five shot. Uh, so it's on my firearm certificate. Uh, I've also got the uh, Winchester Select uh, over and under, which I use on sort of shoot days, proper shoot days. Um, but for, for crows and pigeons and things, then it's the SX3 all the way. Why do you like it? Very reliable, had no problems with it. Um, very rarely jams up, and if it does, it's because I've not cleaned it properly. <laughs> um, and it, it, it cycles whatever you put through it, so no, no problems, shoots well. Now it's not been a very big day today. You have had big days up on these farms? Yeah, um, typically you'd, you'd shoot anywhere between sort of 20 and 50 birds here. Um, I've had 100 bird days and some, some cracking shooting. When, when it's good, it's, it's on a par with a, with a good pheasant day and good sport.